All right, so lesson 76 is on comparing fractions by converting them to a decimal form. So here I have 3 fifths and 5 eighths, and I don't want to know which one is greater. So I'm going to change these both into decimals. So I have 3 divided by 5, and then I'm going to have 5 divided by 8. Okay. So I need to add a decimal and a zero. Decimal. 5 goes into 3 zero times. 5 goes into 30 six times, which is 30, and we zero out. So I know that 3 fifths is the same as 0 0.6. Now I have eight, 5 divided by 8. So again, add a decimal and a zero, decimal and a zero, oops, decimal. 8 goes into 50, and I need to scoot this over so I have enough room. Okay. So 8 goes into 50 six times. That's 48. Subtract it, get 2, add a 0, bring it down. 8 goes into 20 two times. That's 16. Subtract it, add a 0, bring it down. 8 goes into 40 five times, which is 40, and we zero out. So 5 eighths is the same as 0.625. So I know that 5 eighths is greater than 3 fifths. Now here I have 3 fourths and 0 0.7. So I already have 1 as a decimal, so I'm going to change 3 fourths into a decimal number as well. So 3 fourths is 3 divided by 4, add a decimal and a 0. Decimal goes straight up. 4 goes into 3 zero times. 4 goes into 30 seven times. That's 28. Subtract it, get 2 left over, add another 0 and bring it down. 4 goes into 20 5 times, which is 20, and we zero out. So 7, 3 fourths is the same as 0 0.75. So 3 fourths is greater than 0 0.7. Okay, and that's it. Good luck on your homework.